in the featherweight division of UFC Vegas 77. You got Austin Lingo coming in at 9-2. and two. The American takes on a Brazilian, Mel Quizal. Costa, who comes in at 19-6, and six, all types of experience there. Both guys stand 5'10". They're both uh, in their later 20s. Costa, one-inch reach advantage, uh, 71-70 over Costa, or over Lingo, but that's pretty close. Costa stands left-handed. Lingo stands right-handed, so you got opposite stands. Fighters. Now, in terms of uh, activity, that goes to Lingo. 4.2 significant strikes per minute to 2.5 for Costa. Um, neither guy really lands on average a takedown per round, but they're still early on in their career. Now, lights out, Lingo, 78% takedown defense. That'll help even further. He did lose a Nate Landweir. That's a tough fight for him early on in the career by submission, but, but uh, in the UFC beat Luis Saldana by decision and Jacob Kilburn by decision. He also lost to Yusuf Salal back in uh, February of 2020. So that's a long time ago. Now, Costa, 42% takedown defense. That could be a problem if Lingo decides to use it. But that came against Diago Moises, just one UFC fight where he got submitted in the second round and got taken down four times. So it's really hard to judge uh, where Costa is uh, at this point in his career, especially in terms of the UFC, because he came in at 19-5, and five, but he lost five fights outside the UFC, right? That, that could be a problem, unless he just had great competition. Lingo uh, came into the UFC, and that's the only place he got his losses. You know, he, he was 8-0, uh, no, no, excuse me, 7-0 and coming into the UFC. But despite all that, Costa is still a favorite because uh, of how many fights he's had in MMA. People are believing he's going to win this fight. But I'm not necessarily a believer because his takedown defense is weak, right? Uh, he doesn't land nearly as many significant strikes per minute than Lingo. So the only reason that Costa is a, over a 2-1 to one favorite is because he has 25 fights under his belt. But I still think Lingo is going to find a way to win this fight. I think it's going to happen in the third round, you know, because Lingo is going to have to get past a guy that's a veteran that has experience uh, in Costa. But he'll do that, in my opinion, right? He's going to defend the takedown attempts pretty well. Maybe he gives up one in the first two rounds. But in round three, he will dominate and maybe even get the finish. But to me, he's going to win on significant strikes to move to 10 and 2. He'll win two of the three rounds. Uh, definitely the third round, and he'll split rounds one and two to get the win here in the featherweight division at UFC Vegas 77.